Mallet finger refers to injury of the extensor tendon at the distal interphalangeal joint. It occurs when an extended finger is forcibly flexed, such as when a finger is hit on the head with a basketball or volleyball. On examination, the finger is held in flexion and cannot be actively extended. However, it can be passively extended. If it cannot be extended, or if there's suspicion of fracture or subluxation, then a surgical referral is warranted. In uncomplicated injuries, the distal interphalangeal joint should be splinted in full extension, or even slight hyperextension, for 6-8 to eight weeks, and patients should be warned not to flex their injured finger during this time. Following recovery, a brief period of night splinting as well as splinting or taping during activity is advised. I hope you found this lecture to be helpful and worth your time. Please feel free and very welcome to leave a comment or suggestion below. And if you like this video, please hit subscribe and check out some of the other videos in this channel.